Well, I was um, contacted by the Ministry of Home Affairs through CEO Kevin Arters. Um, they had been contacted by Mr. Reggie Bullock, who was coming to Belize on vacation. And um, he reached out wanting to engage with our young people, have a conversation with them and kind of, you know, really make an impact on their lives. So what you're doing here is just to facilitate that for them, for him actually, and to um, give these young people an opportunity to meet an NBA player, um, something that they may never get an opportunity to do. If you notice around the city or the country, what is happening is they are doing a lot of programs for people who are already in gangs. We are, these kids are at, you, at risk kids. So to do something like this for them, to show them that somebody of, uh, of this nature can come and speak to them positively, it's something great for them. And I see that I think we need to have more positive things like this within our society for our high school students as well. It's all a part of us implementing this new approach uh, to fighting crime, uh, particularly in Belize City. Um, as you mentioned, on the last occasion, we brought uh, uh, an NFL Hall of Famer, Ed Reed, um, and he really wanted to visit in the prisons and visit with those at-risk youth um, and to inspire them and motivate them and certainly lead them on a more positive path in life. Um, today, we're extremely grateful to have with us um, an NBA star uh, who was in the Western Conference Finals. He is, in fact, a, a starting player for the Dallas Mavericks. Uh, he just set the franchise record for the Dallas Mavericks with 53 pointers in the playoffs. And he's also, and this, this part is near and dear to me, he's also the recipient of the Kareem Abdul-Jabbar Social Justice Award. And that means so much to me that he is actually here because as Belizeans, we always appreciate and, and we're very proud when celebrities come to Belize to vacation. Um, and we're even more proud when they come and they want to invest in Belize and they love Belize. But the huge and added bonus in all of this is when you have somebody like a Reggie Bullock who wants to give back, who wants to meet with the locals, who wants to interact with our youth um, and certainly make a positive impact in their lives. What I'm hoping from this is that they can really get a, a, a clearer picture of what it takes to excel in basketball, see someone who is at that level but, is, but finds them important enough to come and engage with them. You know, many times our young people don't feel valued, but you have an NBA player who chose to come to our country and speak to you guys. So I'm hopeful they find credit in that, find value in that, and that inspires them.